happens to today, well, we are in Israel, and some of the most critical challenges facing society are occurring in the Middle East. Iran and Iraq and Syria and Lebanon and Saudi Arabia and Egypt and Libya, the Arab Spring, the Israeli and Arab dynamics. A lot of the technology which has been employed in political structuring has been European and Western and only in the last 50 years, 60 years, has a Jewish intellectual presence been strong enough to make a difference and that has born a, a, a strong country and a, a strong identity which is rooted in tradition but in science and in multiculturalism and in all, it seems many of the nuances which have made Western society so so strong. Uh, for example, the United States, which had as its motto, give me your weak and your elderly and your sick, uh, the idea of accepting people from all over the world of different, uh, of different nations and different religions and of different uh, ideologies, as long as they had uh, a free heart and they, uh, they wanted to be part of the American dream. Uh, that was a winning ideology and that was also accepted by the colonies like Australia and Canada and in many ways Israel, uh, which was a, a British, uh, a, 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 which was under the British mandate and was as if a British colony. Uh, had adopted many of these same ideas, but these actually have their antecedents in biblical thought too. The idea that the stranger would be welcome uh, or would be treated equally and have the same law as the um, as the citizen, uh, so uh, of equal rights. So, in Israel's very internal dialogue there exists some of the seeds which are very important in universal thinking. So when you ask what the relevance is for Israel, for here, for, for theology, for thinking about how religion can contextualize, what is the function of religion? And really, um, what is the function of religion? Well, there are many, many functions and this whole, these sessions are really going to pinpoint them, you know, put a, you know, index what these functions are, because they, uh, religion is, a, is almost like an archive. We, we see it almost as if it were a, a, a religion or a devotion, but it really is uh, an awareness of an archive of, of experiences, you know, of ideas, and of rituals, and of, of almost like the what is what is braille? What is would be braille to the blind to the social? A a form of braille to an to a to a person blind of the presence of knowledge before them, uh, but uh, with with help could be it could be brought to their attention. So uh, let's leave it at that.